Street legal racing red line people. The car game you either fully know about or you just don't know and you think I'm spastic. But whatever the answer is, you're still on this video anyway. So welcome. This game is like a car racing, free roam, open world. I mean, it's literally got everything. Okay, literally everything you want in a racing game. You know what's funny though about this game? I was actually looking up some facts, right, about it. And I, because again, I wanted to know more about the game. It only came out on Windows in 2003 and it was published by Activision. I think it's like a sub department of Activision and barely anyone even knows about it. I didn't even know about this game, you know, when I saw it on Steam for like a quid. And I also wanted to know if it came up with any other DLCs or anything. Literally nothing, just this game. Well then let's just start off with our new career then, shall we? Let's just jump right into it and I'll tell you a lot more about the game. Um, let's do... There we go. Welcome to Street Legal Racing. Your garage is empty. You can buy cars. Yeah, so you can go to used dealer, new dealer. We've only got 25k, but I'll show you a lot a little trick down later in the video. Well, that's first off. I, I just want to say that I'm honestly shot. I'll, I'll be honest because not that many people, even in 2003, in 03, had any sort of computer. That's when computers were first starting to get decent and decent. You know, you'd have to take out like two grand loan to just to pay a one of them box computers, which is mad, honestly. That's mad that it came out on Windows in 2003. But anyways, the main focus of the game is... In customization is out is is in actually sane okay like when i say customization literally you can buy car shells engine swaps you can do e12 in a dude it's insane so let's say we want to go use car dealer right open hours only seven to five which also is really cool and they've only got two cars in the shop they've got this one and like a golf gti looking one which is missing oh no we've got one over there it's is that all right? 18k. Got all wheels on it. As we'll cop this one then. A 1.8 liter naturally aspirated engine. There we go. We copped it. Bitchy when I tell you, right? Engine, gasket, engine, gasket, intake manifold, GT block. And then I believe if you go to, you can also go trade in cars as well. It's in mad for like another one. You go engine, uh, I don't know, V8. You've got engine blocks, crankshaft, connecting one, pistons, da -da 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 -da. transmissions. E16. I mean, who? And can I just say, I'm actually surprised that they've got all of these companies that are actually in this game. I'm surprised. You've got steering wheels, dashboards. Besides the point, you've got stock body parts, you've got yeah, aftermarket body parts, like numerous amount of shit that you can get, you know? And you can do that so you can see inside the car. Who's beyond its time, okay? And you could literally go out like that. No headlights if you wanted to. Let me just show you what this game's really about. Let's go open, let's go to Velo City. If you don't know what that means, Velocity. There we go. Welcome to Velo City. Find opponents from your club to race for money. Prizes are just for prestige. Get to know them so that you know who to race at the night times. Yeah, so night races. So there's two different types of races you can do. There's night races, which make more money and you can beat more people. And then day races, which again, you can, still can do. Yeah, as like it says here, beware of the cops. Pulling over is often easier than trying to get away. I don't know how, how do I shift? I forgot how to play this game. Yeah, so basically you can stall cars in this game. Um, I want to see if my controller works. So just give me two. I don't think this game's so old. I don't think it will work. But we got 17,000 games on the clock, which is good. Oh, there we go. Z and A. That is really awkward. Why is, right, so we got... I need to get used to controls. Yeah, it's really jank, the driving. Okay. I, I Can I just say it is really jank? This map is actually quite big. Oh, I was money shifted it there. For example, I could correct crash. This... the. Crash damage physics is really good because it affects the way your car drives anyway. So let's say for example, I don't know. Right? The damage isn't good. And it can actually f our engine and stuff like that. So we can uh, what we can do is we can actually repair the whole car. Way ahead of its time. Way, way, way ahead of its time. Let me show you lot um the customization features basically. Oh, and by the way, as you can see, the damage actually affects your paint. And again, you have to go, let's say go here. Paint booth, you can respray it. Like, I don't know, bigger, whatever color you want. Oh, you, sorry, you need to actually buy the paint. You can spray it. Whatever. And there you go, there's your brand new detailed car. <laughs> it's sick. So let's do a couple of races then, shall we? Let's do it. Um, your car needs to m match like certain requirements, right? Engine power max 100. Like, I've got like 180 or something. And this one, we can do this race, right? Entry fees 100, but we can win 500. Clean driving, uh, puzzle spin 5. Let's go have a little go then. I don't know, Scirocco looking things. My paint job looks like someone's shat on it, okay? It looks like someone's done a massive shit. No! Ooh! Shift it. Is yes, you have multiple dry, uh, again, races like this. So you can do, again, in the free roam, you can as well do that. To be fair, the handling in this game isn't too bad either, knowing that it's from 2003. It's not bad. And I don't know what track, generic track, I think. No ABS, as you can tell. Understeer actually happens in this game, which I like. Vodafone sponsoring? Yeah, but the graphics. Fix. A bit poo-poo. I'll be honest. It's a bit shit. Oh, I went off the track. Oh, no. All right. But that, that doesn't count. 
Say! How many laps? We've got two laps. That's fine. This track is long as fuck. Break. Oh, shit. And I don't know if the engine you can actually money shift. I think you can. There's probably mods that you can. The modding potential in this game. If you go have a look at the Steam Live. Uh, not Steam Live. Steam Community. I'm just taking corners like a G and the game won't just. Nah! I'm not taking pits. You can piss off, mate. Rude driving. Penalty. You can piss off. I'm not going into the pits. For what? Taking cor. Oh, shit. As you can see, we failed that and we lost 100. But it's okay. All right, we've got 59 amateur events. We can do We can do a drag race. Let's, I'm willing to do a drag race. Come on. We've got um, demo derbies as well, which is insane back in the day. Go! From your drive. Off. Oh, how is he beating me? Yeah, and you got races like that, um, which again, I've lost. And then you got, again, just total races. You got some police ones as well. Here you go. Uh, and then you got really, really Derby Arena. You can't participate because I need, but we can bypass all of this. Do you know how? There's actual cheat codes in this game. You heard that right? Actual, like cheat codes, but like on your, you need to type stuff in. I'm going to get them up because I forgot what they are. Here we've got 500k and we've got this car. So we've had to switch accounts because again, apparently we've got another account on here. And yeah, we've got 500k. Okay. So at the end of the day, it doesn't matter. Oh, I'll show you. So you can go to a new auto, buy brand new cars. But that's what they've got in stock. They've got, you can open the engine. They've got what, four cylinder, five. That shit. Um, you trained in some cars as well. So, um, yeah, I'll show you quickly. I could buy, I don't know, that, that, that. I want to buy this. This is a convertible. Or we can just wait, uh, skip the time to next day. This is day three. We can go again. See what they've restocked. Like, that looks like a proper sports car. That looks insane as well. Oh, this is an MR2. That's ugly. Uh, I think there's an exotic dealer as well, but I don't know where that is. That's my car. I could sell my car if I want. I can buy any car in the game. Any car I wish, I choose. I don't know what this is. Uh, we'll buy this. Oh my f***ing god. I don't know what this car even is. What is that? That's a V12. Oh my god, I can see inside the engine. Right, I want to test this out. So let's do a couple of races with it then. Let's go out in the Valo City and let's do some races. Whoa, 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 whoa. This reps to 14,000. Right, let's go do some races then. Let's, let me whip it round. That did not sound good, whatever that was. <laughs> what the hell, man? Here we are. So, here's the race. Uh, we can participate in it. Or we can watch race. So, again, let's race this guy. I don't know. Bet. Let's bet 8K. Because we we know we're going to win. This does 4, 4. This does 225 miles an hour. Two, one. Bye-bye. Oh my god, the engine says this is... Oh, what have I done to the car already? Jesus. I don't know what this car is. I just chose it because it says test me. Um, yeah, those are the races and then you'd, you know, do more, etc, etc. What happens if I, like, go, like, 100 and fucking, like, 300 miles an hour, 200? Well, oh, actually, does my game break or something? Ooh! No. So, for some reason, you can't put it in the NFL. So, if I do test me again, I want to... What are the cars that they got? There we go. Okay, we've... Ranked top S cloud, and then we get this, and then I get that car as well, which is mad. Right, so now I'm gonna going to go do and show you lot. Demo Derby in my f probably 60k car. Imagine look at all these people in their shit cars, and I got my f I brought my f thing. Oh, it's a Supra. Great, great. Oh, that was the quickest Derby I think I've ever. But yeah, boys. Uh, I think that's honestly about it. Holy, I wanna drive that? That's about it from me. I mean, I'm so glad that I've actually hopped on and, you know, Street Legal Road and found it because this game is so underrated. For you lot that are actually into, like, building cars, like, this game is for you. You can swap in engines, swap out, build cars from chassis. It's insane, okay? I mean, just what it is, it's just Beam and G. It's just, what it is basically is Beam and G, but what it wants to be now with the career mode. But I don't know, from like 20 years ago. Rigs of Rods were a thing, you know? I think, again, like I said, it's honestly such an underrated game. So many mods you can download as well. The modding potential is ridiculous on this. Go have a look yourself on Steam. And yeah, I'll see you lot in the next one. See you lot then.